would a difference be between a yin problem and a yang problem? Am I pronouncing that right? I'm so yes, sorry. Yes, yes. Okay, so let me just make a very, I think everybody experience insomnia. Insomnia, right? Right. Okay. Yeah, you in, can't sleep. And, and night, you can't sleep. Okay, so in means water, means night, means moon. Okay? Woman. Okay. Yang means fire, means sun, ha sun. Okay? So sun come out in the morning. Moon come out at night, yeah? So when you go to sleep, the moon should be coming up, right? And the water should be flow, right? So when you cannot sleep at night, what does that tell you? You have so much heat, you have so much fire, your sun still up, your moon never shine. Therefore, so where that fire coming from, right? Why your sun still hanging there, your moon doesn't come up. Okay, so are you thinking too much? Okay, when you're thinking too much, the brain is associated also with your heart. Okay, not heart, heart, mind. Yeah, your mind is still going. That's a fire. So at night, if you still stress, you still on fire, your moon will never come out, right? So how did I treat that, right? So I have to put out that fire. I have to nourish in the flow, the water bring into your body. So I can bring that fire down to nourish the fluid, the water in, in your body, okay? So you can sleep. So you can say like a menopause, why they cannot sleep either? Because the hormone, hormone is an in factor, right? Hormone is a flu, is an in factor. Your flu goes down, your hormone goes down. Of course, at night, your sun to hang there, the moon never shine. You can't sleep, <laughs> right? That is the perfect explanation. <laughs> oh my goodness. Right, right. It makes so much sense. And that's maybe why when I speak to some people, you know, their routine, their nighttime routine, I'm like, you got to start, have no electronics because your mind goes to the electronics. Take a bath fire, before right? you go to bed, right? Stimulation. It's fire. Stimulation. Your mind is fire, right? Yeah. So you got to calm down, right? And even yeah. journaling, like write it down, put it out of your mind and then yeah. bring that moon calm up. Calm down right? I love that. I love that. <laughs> now, For more on journaling through infertility, please visit our website at journalingthrough.life where we connect body, mind, spirit. Keep journaling and keep growing.